How to record consignment sales in QuickBooks Online. First, we need to know what is consignment sales. Consignment occurs when goods are sent by their owner, the consignor, to an agent, the consignee, who undertakes to sell the goods. The consignor continues to own the goods until they are sold. So the goods appear as inventory in the accounting records of the consignor or the consignee. To clarify, we'll work on the following example. The company sold equipment one for $90,000 to customer one as a consignment. As a consignment, the company wants equipment one to still show as inventory in the records. And the customer doesn't want this transaction to show in their monthly statement. However, the company still wants it to be shown in the customer transaction list for tracking purposes. How to do this in QuickBooks Online? We do this by creating a delayed charge in QuickBooks Online. What is a delayed charge? A delayed charge in QuickBooks Online is a transaction that will be billed on a future date. To create consignment sales, we go to New and then choose Delayed Charge. But before we do this, we need to check the inventory. We go to Sales, Products and Services, Equipment 1 here, Quantity on Hand is 6. Okay, so let's go to new and create delayed charge and choose customer one. Choose the equipment from here and the quantity is one. And we remember that quantity on hand is six. Okay, the rate is 90,000, then save and close. Okay, so refresh this, like some services. Quantity on hand didn't change. Okay. And then let's go to customers. We need to check if it shows on the customer statement or not. The customer one statement. Statement date is today. Hand preview. Okay, so transaction doesn't show here. Is that what we want? Let's check the transaction list. The charge is here. And D4500. That's correct. So that what we actually needed to do is to put the transaction under the transaction list. And at the same time doesn't show on the customer statement because the customer is not built for it and also to still keep it in our inventory records. So that's it for today, thanks.